As the global and national stock TV champion, Nigeria's first lady, Olure Mitinumbu, is expected to lend her voice and resources to the campaign in order to stop the spread of tuberculosis around the world. She is here on that duty as the Stop TV Partnership rallies stakeholders in New York in a renewed bid to break the resistance of the scourge. Her keynote address acknowledges that tuberculosis, with its drug-resistant nature, is a tough nut, which she ever believes is not beyond the will and resources of the world to crack. We have the tools, the knowledge, and the expertise to end TB and AMR by 2030. Addressing TB and AMR together is not just the smart way, it is the best and only way. Our methods must include improving awareness, education on the dangers of drug-resistant TB, and promoting the appropriate use of antibiotics. We must also prioritize research in order to develop new tools, treatments, and new vaccines that can outpace the evolving threat um, of AMR. In Nigeria, where the intervention of a pet project the Need Hope Initiative has led to the procurement of 25 TB molecular diagnostic machines and reagents that can conduct over 15,000 tests. The race to change the tuberculosis narrative ahead of 2030 is on. I'm also informed that this support has motivated the manufacturers and global distributors, together with their partners in Nigeria, to donate an additional 50 TB lamps to aid the country in the fight against tuberculosis. In addition, first ladies of various states in Nigeria who double as stop TB champions and I will be embarking on a nationwide TB advocacy to accelerate improved diagnosis and um, prompt treatment. To fully move the needle on tuberculosis and AMR, the executive director Stop TB Partnership, Lucica Dittio, harped on the need for strong collaboration, noting that the battle cannot be won in isolation. What is clear from the submission of Nigeria's first lady and that of other speakers is that a multi-sectorial approach involving a lot of research and advocacy is required to achieve the objective of ending tuberculosis by 2030. And indeed, that is what Nigerians and the rest of the world are expecting in order to achieve a future where tuberculosis is no longer a threat.